Good evening, Sioux Falls Police need your help tonight to find a man connected with the deadly weekend shooting. Just before 3.30 this afternoon, police issued an arrest warrant for 24-year-old Abraham Darsaw. He's wanted for multiple charges, including second-degree murder. Officers say that this all started with a group of people at a barbecue just north of Falls Park. Investigators believe the two men got into an argument over a woman. The fight escalated, leading to the suspect allegedly shooting and killing a 25-year-old man. A 22-year-old is also in the hospital. Kelloland's Brady Mallory found the court papers that describe what happened and joins us with new details. Brady? Well, the shooting happened in the same area where the farmer's market sets up shop during the weekend. According to the affidavit, Darsaw and the two victims got into an argument over someone disrespecting a woman. During that argument, Darsaw allegedly pulled out a 9mm Ruger semi-automatic pistol and fired three rounds. One round hit a victim in the chest. Another hit a different man in the lower abdomen. Witnesses say Darsaw allegedly threw the pistol and then ran away. The search for the suspect started with a lot of questions about what happened. I think shelter. Buddy, you hold Normally, this is where people go to buy produce during the summer weekends. Today, a worker was washing away a different weekend activity that turned into tragedy. Everything seems to be pointing towards one particular suspect. Anyone in here, victim or suspect? Police started searching last night for the suspect while also talking with as many people as they could. Public information officer Sam Clemens says this isn't a random shooting. Because investigators believe most everyone in the group knew each other. What we've heard so far from the witnesses, it, it just really sounds like there was bad blood between these guys. Clemens says the men started arguing and then became violent. This led to some pushing and shoving. Eventually, the suspect pulled out a gun and allegedly started shooting. Witnesses say Darsaw was with two other people and they were seen in a Pontiac torrent. Officers later found the car and the other two people near Spring and 37th, but not Darsaw. So Brady, has Darsaw been in trouble with police before? Mm -hmm. Yes, I checked his record and he has faced multiple charges in the past, including drug possession. Actually, his last arrest was less than a month ago for allegedly resisting and interfering with an officer and marijuana possession.